that go on strike, including in some cases ones that are actually owned by the state. At least in one case, there was a, a natural gas facility that was owned by the state that was on strike. Um, I don't know if they've been able to maintain that consistently on an ongoing basis or if they were forced to work in some days. The Islamic regime has many ways of forcing uh forcing citizens to do things. One of the things that they have exercised both within Iran and outside of Iran is threatening and arresting and torturing sometimes family members of Iranians. In one case, there was a woman, uh, Iranian French woman based in Paris who received a call from Iranian intelligence telling them that if she didn't stop posting on Instagram against the regime that they would arrest her family and put them in Evan prison. So I would not be surprised if these are some of the same tactic tactics that are being used to force workers to go back to work when it comes to strikes. That being said, I would encourage them and anybody who has the ability to support them, um, I would encourage them to continue uh, with these strikes. I do think it's critical towards actually making a change in, in Iran. Mm -hmm.